EA Games. Challenge everything. There was nothing about the starry sky that night to suggest that strange and mysterious things would soon be happening. Hagrid, at last. And where did you get that motorbike? Borrowed it, Professor Dumbledore, sir. No problems, were there? No, sir. House was almost destroyed, but I got him out all right. Nestled in the bundle was a baby. Harry Potter, the boy who lived. For the next 11 years, Harry lived with his dreadful Aunt Petunia, Uncle Vernon, and cousin Dudley, the Dursleys. Then, one day, he received a letter inviting him to attend Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Told you, didn't I, Harry? Told you you was famous. Professor Quirrell. Harry, Professor Quirrell will be one of your teachers at Hogwarts. Potter, can't tell you how pleased I am to meet you. What sort of magic do you teach, Professor Quirrell? D -d Defence against the dark arts. Not that you need it, eh, P Potter? You'll be getting all your equipment, I suppose. I've got to pick up a new book on vampires myself. Must get on, lots to buy. Come on, Harry. Three up, two across. Right, stand back, Harry. Welcome to Diagon Alley. Just your wand left from Ollivander's. Oh yeah, and I still haven't got your birthday present. Hello? Good afternoon. Ah, yes. Yes, yes. I thought I'd be seeing you soon, Harry Potter. You have your mother's eyes. It seems only yesterday she was in here herself. Buying her first wand, ten and a quarter inches long, swishy, made of willow. Nice wand for charm work. Your father, on the other hand, favored a mahogany wand. Well, I say your father favored it. It's really the wand that chooses the wizard, of course. Well now, Mr. Potter, let's get started, shall we? If you'll kindly follow me. Have a look around, Mr. Potter. When you find a wand you like, pick it up. 
and let's see if it likes you. Have a look around, Mr. Potter. Have a look around, Mr. Potter. Beechwood and Dragon Heartstring. Nine inches. Nice and flexible. Stand over there, on that platform to try your wand. Go on, go on, try it out. My goodness, definitely not. Beechwood and Dragon Heartstring. Nine inches. Nice and flexible. Holly and Phoenix Feather. Eleven inch. Ebony and Unicorn Hair. Eight and a half inches. Springy. Ebony and unicorn hair. Holly and phoenix feather. Eleven inches. Nice and supple. Go on, go on, try it out. Very curious. Sorry, but what curious? I remember every wand I've ever sold, Mr. Potter. Every single wand. It so happens 
that the phoenix, whose tail feather is in your wand, gave another feather. Just one other. It is very curious indeed that you should be destined for this wand when it's brother. Why its brother gave you that scar? Yes. Curious indeed how these things happen. The wand chooses the wizard, remember? I think we must expect great things from you, Mr. Potter. After all, he who must not be named did great things. Terrible, yes, but great. Please retrieve the spell book that lies beyond. It will prove most valuable in all that lies ahead. Over here, Mr. Potter. Yuck! Grass flavour! Mmm, curry! Coconut. Yuck! Grass flavour! Mmm! Peppermint! Mmm! Coconut! Mmm! Coffee! Ugh! Liver! Flavor, revolting vomit flavor. Fishy sardine flavor. Mmm, coffee. Mmm, coconut. Oh, oh, bogey. Mmm, marmalade. Booger flavour. Mmm, coffee. Spinach flavour. Mmm, mmm, coffee. Flavor. Yuck! Grass flavor! Yuck! Grass flavor! Mmm, chocolate! 
pick up this spell book to gain the Flipendo knockback jinx. Pick up this spell book to gain the Flipendo knockback jinx. Bravo, yes indeed. Oh, very good. Well done, Mr. Potter. Once you learn some more powerful magic, you'll be able to cast more powerful Flipendo knockback jinxes. If you'd kindly follow me. Liver? I must aim my spells at them. Oh, bogey. Mmm, chocolate. A wizard card! Felix Summerby 1447 to 1508 Inventor of cheering charms Mmm, curry. Ugh, tripe. These three large shields on the far wall can be flipped using your Flipendo knockback jinx. Flip them in the correct order. Mmm, peppermint. Coconut. Target the shields and flipendo them.
target the shields and flipendo them. Before continuing, it may be wise to collect the folio bruti. These imps can be a nuisance. Try knocking them over with flipendo, then pick them up and lock them in the cages. If you'd kindly follow me. A cauldron cake! A pumpkin pasty! Alberta Tootil, 1391 to 1483, winner of the All England Wizarding Dueling Competition of 1430, famously overcame the favourite Samson Wiblin with a blasting curse. a spell while moving. You need to target the shield on this device and continue to cast Flipendo at it until the central section locks into place. Try and keep up, Mr. Potter. You must keep the shield targeted. Done, Mr. Potter. Have a look around, Mr. Potter.
With the knowledge contained in this book, you'll be able to cast more powerful spells. Here's a helpful hint from the book just for you. Build up the power on your wand, but be careful. Don't overpower your spells, or you could end up in a spot of trouble. This time, I'd like you to power up the Flipendo spell before casting it. Like this. Flipendo! Have you read the book I gave you yet? To cast really powerful spells, you need to build up the power on your wand and cast it when the spell is ready. Done, Mr. Potter. Godric Gryffindor. Medieval, dates unknown. Co-founder of Hogwarts. Gave his name to one of the four Hogwarts houses. If you'd kindly follow me. Hey, Harry. Happy birthday, Harry. She's beautiful. What's her name? Her name's Hedwig, and she's yours to keep. Thanks, Hagrid. We best be going now. The Hogwarts Express is leaving very soon, and you don't want to miss it. The train slowed right down and finally stopped. They followed Hagrid down to the edge of a great black lake. The fleet of little boats moved off all at once, gliding across the lake, which was as smooth as glass. Everyone was silent until... Ooh, wicked! One by one, each of the first years was sorted into his or her house. And what of Harry Potter? Not Slytherin! Not Slytherin! Not Slytherin, eh? Are you sure? You could be great, you know. It's all here, in your head. No? Well, if you're sure, better be Gryffindor! Hey, Harry! Hello! I'm Ron Weasley. I'm in Gryffindor, too. It's no surprise, really. All my brothers are in Gryffindor. So, why do you think Professor Dumbledore put the third for House of Bounds? I really don't know. We've got to follow that prefect. It's odd, because he usually gives us a reason why we're not allowed to go somewhere. I do think he might have told us prefects at least. That prefects Percy, my other brother. How many brothers have you got? Too many. My name's Hermione Granger, by the way. And you are? Uh, Ron. Ron Weasley. Pleasure. You've got something on your nose. Huh? You must be Harry Potter. I know all about you, of course. Look out! Filch is coming. We'd better go.
Gryffindors, follow me, please. Keep up. Come on, Harry. We'd better follow Percy up to the Gryffindor common room. Keep up, please, and follow me. Quickly now, come on. You know, when I forget what I'm supposed to be doing, I just look in my remember all. Oh, but it's really great being famous. You know, when I forget what I'm supposed to be doing, I just look in my remember all. Do I know you? Ah, yes. You're the famous Harry Potter. Pleased to meet you. I think Ravenclaw's got the most handsome Quidditch team at Hogwarts. at the ugliest people I've ever seen. There's more to life than Quidditch, you know. You must be worn out, Harry. I know I am. There's more to life than Quidditch, you know. This is the most direct path to the dormitory. Oh, and keep an eye on the staircases. They like to change. Come on, Harry, get to the common room. Come on, Harry, get to the common room. We'd better follow Percy. Keep up, please, and follow me. Quickly now, come on. Follow me, everyone. Keep up. Ugh! Tripe. Cassandra Vablatsky, 1894 to 1997, celebrated seer and author of Unfogging the Future. Keep up, please, and follow me. Quickly now, come on. A poltergeist. <laughs> Ooh, hickle thirsties. What fun. <laughs> Go away, Peeves, or the Baron will hear about this. I mean it. You 
want to watch out for Peeves. The bloody Baron's the only one who can control him. He won't even listen to us prefects. Keep up, please, and follow me. Quickly now, come on. Over here, Harry! Come on, Harry, get to the common room. Keep up, please, and follow me. Quickly now, come on. Follow me, everyone. Keep up. Gather round here. Password? You need a password to enter the common room. This year, it's Caput Draconis. Caput Draconis. Well done, young Gryffindor. That is indeed the correct password. Thanks, Harry. Password? Caput Draconis. Hey, Harry. Fred and George have set up a shop. You can trade all kinds of things with them for spells and really wicked stuff. Wow, I must go and see them. Where are they? Go through that door and through the reading room. There's a portrait on the other side. What's the password? Pig snout. Oh, and watch out for Percy. He hates being disturbed when he's studying. You'll need to stay out of his way. If you're careful, you should be able to creep past him.